hi guys welcome back to my channel i know it's a different setting today it's because i traveled i'm somewhere different um and guys my skin has been doing really great i am so impressed by my new skincare routine my skin feels super soft i wake up like i don't even know how to explain this but i overall i just love my I love how my skin looks, I love how my skin feels. If you're not new here, you know that I started using the ordinary products just a while ago. It's been, uh, is it three months now? I think it's been three months now that since I started using uh, the ordinary products. And guys, it's been quite a journey. It's been a wonderful journey. It's my very first time to, to use products and they don't break me out as in for real so i'm so impressed by these products so i figured i might just want to like come on here and uh, maybe update you guys show you how my skin is looking so it's in the morning i have two routines i have the morning routine and then i have an evening routine i mean a night before bedtime so right now today i just want to show you my two routines that i've been doing every single day i keep switching them up but uh this has been consistent for a while and I just wanted to come on here and show you guys how I've been doing it. So if you into that kind of thing, I would ask that you please consider subscribing and click on that notification bell. The subscribe, it will really mean a lot. So I'm going to show you how I do my skin. Yep. So let me first make sure I... Let's make it look fancy. <laughs> so yeah. So what I usually do in the mornings, I do not cleanse. I don't really cleanse my skin because in the night I do a lot at night, and I wake up with uh, like kind of oily really moisturized skin and there's 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 really nothing to cleanse in the morning because your skin is clean you do not have makeup on so it's i don't think it's necessary to cleanse in the morning so i don't really cleanse in the morning i just use plain water on my face and then proceed on to my next step so let's do that now So once that's done, I go in with my hyaluronic acid right here and I like to move uh, really fast because it's nice to apply this uh, hyaluronic acid when your skin is still down. It absorbs well on a damp skin. So once that's done, I go in with my caffeine solution, the eye cream. Caffeine solution. Yeah. Take just a drop. One drop is enough. This thing has really helped my eyes. Like I, I had a uh, I never noticed that I had dark circles before because I wasn't really taking care of my skin but once I started using this caffeine I use this caffeine in the morning and really I see a huge difference from my before pictures because I took pictures it's always good guys to take pictures before you start a product because that's that's the only way you're gonna know if there is if the product is working or not so if I look onto my before pictures really there's a huge difference Huge, huge difference. So I like to rub it in and then pull. <laughs> All right. So once that's done, my morning routine is um, it's quite simple. 
so I would go in with my um, um, vitamin C this is the ascorbyl glucoside solution 12% I usually switch it up sometimes I use the it's called what the ascorbic acid plus alpha ibutene I started using vitamin C in the morning because at night I go really deep nighttime routines I left them for my acid so at night I use acid in the morning I just use my vitamin C at first I actually thought that vitamin C isn't good to use in the morning but I I read some blog that uh, said vitamin C is really good and this vitamin C these forms of vitamin C are actually stable so they are good and the fact that they are antioxidants they help uh, with the free radicals that happen during the day and it's really nice so it works so i started using this vitamin c before i used to use niacinamide in the morning and then vitamin c sometimes at night but since in the night i use really a lot of products different products i didn't really see where i could uh, where i could uh, add my vitamin c in my routine so i would just use use them once in a while but then once i read that blog i was like okay now i'm gonna start using my vitamin c in the morning so that's what I did and that's what I've been using for, it's been, I think two weeks now I'm using vitamin C in the morning. So this is the glucoside. Sometimes I would use this as coding with buffet. Sometimes I would use it with hyaluronic acid, it depends. So I'll grab it in. So most of the times I use my Escobio, um solution. The 12% uh, escorbyl glucoside solution, I usually use it with buffet because I can use it with buffet, but I cannot use the other ascorbyl plus alpha ibutin because that's uh, considered an acid. I can't use it with the buffet because buffet is a peptide, so it kind of doesn't work well together. So I use the glucoside with the buffet because it's okay to use it together, but then I use the alpha ibutin plus the ascorbic acid plus alpha ibutin. I use them, I use that with hyaluronic acid once I decide to use that. Yeah, so once I'm done going in with my vitamin C, then I would go in with this the natural moisturizing factors. So once all that is done, if you have a sunscreen, you would uh, proceed with your sunscreen. But to be honest, I have no sunscreen, so I've not been using a sunscreen. And uh, yeah, I don't have a sunscreen. I'm really trying to look for a nice sunscreen because I'm afraid because my skin, uh, like uh, my skin has been really, I don't, I won't say sensitive, but before i started using the ordinary products my skin was very reactive to products so i'm afraid of using different products and i didn't really uh, by the time i ordered these ordinary products they didn't have a sunscreen on the website so um, i'm kind of reluctant and hesitant to buy a sunscreen from another brand so that's still a hassle and it's not good using these products that i use and not use a sunscreen so if anyone has any recommendations please do recommend me a nice sunscreen that won't break me out because i'm so trying to clear my skin and at the moment my skin really is at a very good state so i don't really want to jeopardize that so this is how I'll normally be now i'll be done and i would go out um normally i'll try to make sure that i'm not exposed to the sun because i have no sunscreen but that would be it for my mornings and I will finish off with a lip balm. Yeah. This is the Labelle, Labello lip balm. I like uh, this stuff, it's moisturizing. So, this is how I finish it. I don't do makeups in the morning, I go bare first. If I really try to do anything anything in the morning, usually I'll just do my eyebrows and that will be it. I don't do makeups in the morning. I really don't. I, I, I rarely do makeup. So that will be the end of my morning routine. 
and then later on in the night I'll show you guys how I do my nighttime skincare routine and this is how my skin looks like after doing my morning routine my skin really is so like I've never had this kind of skin really I mean I don't remember when I last had this kind of skin so I'm really pretty impressed so this is the finished product for my morning routine see you guys at night <laughs>